Alright guys, so welcome to the Transform and Rollout video for the Magic Square Red Cannon. And of course we have our buddy Sideswiper here already in bot mode, so let's fix that. Pull off weaponry like one is meant to do. And straighten out his arms for the time being. And I know I mentioned it in a review, but the plastics on this feel so scary. So let's come down here. And need to extend the hood, and it's on a slider and a hinge, so it kind of flips up like so. And you really just want to take it up and over the head there, and you sort of see that tabs through there. And kind of just rest it up this way. I don't know if you're meant to close it up just yet, but it wants to. So let's see here. Slide back. Fella. Wants to be a little bit difficult then. Come on. See, it's supposed to slide back on that same slider. There it goes. Alright. Tab in the hood up there, like so. That's what it wants to do. Oh, I know. Okay. I'm dumb. Sorry. I forgot to do things. All right. So hard part is swiveling these shoulders out because you've got a pin here that swivels the entire shoulder and then another one that swivels the wheel. Try to keep them together as best you can. So you want to rotate one, then rotate the other, then rotate the other again. That's a pain in the butt. That's why the hood wasn't closed. And I'm a dummy. Once again, it's just constant rotating of one and then the other. So just get used to it, kind of. And actually, something I forgot, you want to rotate the arms, the forearms, that is, inside. Oops, that wasn't supposed to rotate there, I was supposed to rotate at the bicep. It's been a little while since I've transformed this, guys. Okay, hold on. Flip up the crotch. Then rotate at the waist. Like I said, it's been a little while since I've done this. So bear with me. I'll figure it out. Hold on. Rotate that. Then rotate at the bicep. There we go. Now, they do try to fool you by thinking this is the side of the car when it's actually not. They're tricky. Tricky, tricky. So what you want to end up with is this. Now, let's try to make that a lot smoother on this side, now that I'm a little bit less dumb than I was. But I stressed the little part. Okay. So, arm folded in on itself, and then rotate everybody into place. This is a mildly complex situation here. So, I kind of see why they say to uh, give these two 16-year-olds an up. Okay, so now let's see if we can get that hood closed. And now we can. Good. I'm less stupid now. And once again, those plastics just don't feel great. They just feel weak and not happy. Okay, now for the legs. These are also kind of complex. Fold your toes in. Fold them down like so on that back hinge. And you want to swing this guy out this way and out that way and move the spoiler up and out. Now comes the part where I forget what I'm doing again. Oh, wait, no, that needs to stay down. Come on, between the legs like so. And you want to rotate this up. Oop, I missed a thing. Hold on. These down. This little panel flips out like so. Remembering as I go, 
why console the instructions. Just try to remember how it goes otherwise. So the problem is I have the transformation for the uh, for the siege one in my head. So I was like, I know it doesn't transform like this. Come on. There we go. All right. And now comes the fun part. Once you've got this all rotated up and out the way somehow. Come on. Yeah, I'm definitely not the best at this. Okay, so you want the car sides facing forward. Then you want to grab the shins and slide them forward. They have a slider on the inside, which will help you accommodate that. You can see it right there. So just slide that one up. And I guess we can go ahead and tab together. One thing I do like is that the pins right here that those are sliding on now become exhaust pipes. It's kind of a cool design idea. Now we flip these guys back around. And I tried to remember exactly how this goes because these now become... Oh, hold on. That's got to go under. I always go under with that. Uh, once again, remembering as I go. So these all need to come together. And come down and tab into that, which is not the easiest thing in the world to pull off all in one smooth maneuver. So you kind of have to get this tab into the roof first, and then the side panel down like so. And do everything in your human ability to close up gaps. Because that is the main problem with this guy, as I mentioned in the review, the tail right here will not close up totally, but for the most part, there he is in his little Lamborghini mode. Though, unfortunately, the weapons have nowhere to store. So that part sucks, but we're just here to transform this guy back into his tiny little mode. Yay! Thanks for checking out this video, guys. Sorry, uh, I fumbled a bit. It's a kind of a complex transformation for what it is. So thank you for bearing with me. And, of course, if you somehow found this without checking out the review, make sure you go back and do that. It should be up here in the card. But I will check you out later. If you want to check out the rest of the Taro videos, there will probably be a playlist for that. So just remember, as always, to transform and roll out.